Welcome, my name is Mario and today I'm going to show you how to ingest host metrics into Sumo Logic using an already installed collector. It's possible that you might need to upgrade your collector. Let's take a peek. Let's go into Manage Collection. In the Collectors page, you might notice this link called Upgrade Collectors, which is showing you which collectors are not in the latest version. Latest version is noted up here on the top left hand side and the current version is listed for each collector. In order for you to load host metrics, you need to be on at least 19.155 or higher. I'm going to upgrade this collector to give me the ability to load host metrics. Once my collector has been upgraded, I can start installing a source for my host metrics. Let's look for the installed collector I just upgraded. It's called host server. And if I click on add, I have the ability to add a source. And one of the options I have now is host metrics because I have upgraded to the latest version. By clicking on host metrics, I can set up the source. And for those of you who have worked with collectors and sources in the past, this should look very straightforward. I'm going to call it server host one. I'm going to call my host server host one as well. And for source category, let's call it metrics host apps. I can specify the interval that I want to scan those metrics. I'll leave it to the default of one minute. And then I can specify which metrics I want included. If I expand this sort, this categories, I can see each and every one of the metrics within that, along with an explanation of what the metric is. For now, I'm going to select all the metrics in here and click on Save. This year now have successfully built my source. I can go back to those collectors, look for my host server collector that I just uh, added a source for, and there it is. Here is my server host one, which is the source for the host server that I built in here. Great, let's go find out if we have data. I'm gonna to go to the metrics tab and run a query to, against my source category to see if I have any data. Source category equals, if you remember, I believe we selected metric host apps, and I can specify a particular metric. Choose the tag metric, and let's choose a value of, how about uh, CPU idle? And look for that particular metric. There you go. This is looking for the last 15 minutes worth of data. Of course, I don't have the, the other 13 minutes because I just started loading data through this collector. Similarly, I could look for all the fields that start with CPU. And as you can imagine, I would get a lot of different lines, CPU system, CPU user, CPU idle, and so on. Now let's not stop here. I'm gonna show you how to install an app that has out of the box content about your host metrics. In this case, it's found under preview, although preview and apps tend to have about the same. Here is my host metrics, and I'm gonna install all these different dashboards so that I can easily start viewing the content of my host metrics. Click on install, select the source category that is meaningful. I believe ours was uh, metric host apps, and then specify where we wanna store it. I'm gonna put it under my apps folder under host metrics and click on install. Once this app has been installed, I can go to it and I can see the different dashboards that are in this folder. Let's open the overview and how about CPU as well. What this does is it opens two new tabs for the dashboards that I selected. The overview dashboard gives me a good overview of all the different metrics found in my host metrics. CPU idle, CPU load time, total used, free system memory, disks used, disks available, network in and out bytes per host. Similarly, I have dashboards for all each one of the different areas like CPU, network, TCP, IP, and you get the point. Now, don't forget to share this app with the other users in your organization. And you can do that by going into the folder that you want to specify, in my case, host metrics, and I can click on this publishing icon. This is gonna make sure that this folder gets published and shared with everybody else in my organization so they can take advantage of all these different dashboards that have been installed out of the box. Great, I just showed you how to upgrade a collector so you can start ingesting all your host metrics and also how to install the app so you can get this out of the box content and start taking advantage of all the information that your host metrics provide. Thank you.